It's the M&D Clemens. And we back, and we back. <laughs> Yay! Sorry, just for a minute. Woo! What the years it has been. But this video is about how we met. Matt, yeah. Okay? <laughs> Want to get on into that? Mm, juicy, juicy, juicy. How we met. <laughs> it's different. But yes, we are back. Um, you guys are noticing that you're seeing all these videos um, that have been in my archives that is just old but we never got a chance to post because life just happened and there was a lot going on and so now that we're able to post them you're gonna get two years worth of stuff that we didn't get a chance to post <laughs> on top of our current situation and us in our life now yeah. okay so let's talk about how we met i'm gonna give my version <laughs> you can intercept if you're <laughs> gonna say you can intercept if you saying what I'm saying is not incorrect. Let's all right, do all it right, that all way. Right, all right. Okay. So I don't even know how many years ago was this. How many years? Over ago five. Was this? Over five years. Well, of course. Um, Where do we meet at? Okay, but let's do it this. Okay. <laughs> so of course, yes, I was dating someone, and my girlfriend. You know, I had found out some stuff, and she was like, "Girl, let's go out." And I'm not a go out type of person, you know, I just didn't do that. And so I was like, eh, okay, I guess, you know, you know, pumping myself up because I'm like, yeah, you know, we did this, whatever, yeah, I'm going out. And so um, I decided to go out, and me and my girl went out and we went to RB Live. Yes. I had never been, and people like, oh, you met the club. No, it is a RB concert that you have live where you're allowed to also dance and have a good time. So what happens is, is artists and everything, they come out as you're dancing and you don't know. They always say surprise artists, right? Yeah. They don't tell you who's, you know, exactly coming out. You, as you're dancing and stuff, then you're like, oh, yo. Yeah. And for us, Maya, Maya was yeah. there, which was pretty cool. Um, she it's came just, out. Who else? Wasn't it somebody life. else? No, it was, it was Maya. Was it just Maya? It was just Maya. I thought it was another artist. Or was it just her? It was just a okay. Group. Well, yes, it was R&B Live in California. Um, I don't remember. Do you know where it was at? Downtown. I know it was downtown. It was downtown. I know it was downtown. It was one of the big ones. It was just so much fun. Yeah. And so yeah. I get there with my girl, and me and her just chilling, and we having us a good time. I'm the type of person I just like to dance. I don't really care for people mm -hmm. to be around me. I don't really dance with people. I just like to have a good time. You know, don't mind talking to folk and stuff like that. But I rather, if I'm not there with who I'm dating, I will just have a good time with my girlfriend and we'll just sit there and dance and, you know, just have a good time. So we're just sitting there, me and her just partying, having just the time of our life. They was playing really good R&B music, um, you know, nothing crazy. And then I'm just sitting there dancing, chilling, looking ready. And I'm like, what? Who, who is this behind <laughs> me? And I yeah. never look back. And I do not do that, which is very odd. But because we were having so much fun, and I was like, okay, he can dance a little. I mean, okay. A little? So I so I didn't, <laughs> I never looked back. Like, literally, I didn't at the at the moment. And so I was just having, babe, really? I was just having a good time. It was just so much fun, and we were dancing. Mm -hmm. And then so as we're dancing and everything, I finally, you know, turned around like, oh, okay, what's up? Hi, how are you? You know, and... Then that's when everybody was just questioning each other and, you know, talking and having things to ask. And so then that's when... Your boy can dance. What? I don't know about all that. Stop playing. <laughs> I don't know about all that. But it was good enough. Because usually I'm like, if you can't dance, then I, you're not dancing with me. So that was... Because I got that. <laughs> so um, we're just talking and then... um. You know, asking questions and stuff like that. You know, first thing, guys, like, you got a man and things like that. And, of course, I was like, yes, I'm very honest. You know, I'm not somebody to lie, right? <laughs> we <me>. joking. <laughs> <laughs> you caught on. You, you get what I'm saying. She's smart, though. Oh, my gosh. So, anyways... As we were talking, you know, he asked those questions. And, of course, I asked the same. So, I was honest. I was honest. <laughs> um, I can't say that for him. <laughs> can't say that for him. We'll get into that. But 
Babe, can I, can I finish this? Let me finish talking first. Then you, you if you want to say something, you can say something. And so, um, so yes, we were just having a good time, you know, exchanged Instagrams and things like that. And I was just like, okay, that's nice. You know, but I, of course I wasn't trying to talk to anybody because I was already with someone. And um, so it, it stayed there. So we had a good time. Um, it was, what was one thing that was really funny is when, I will say this, when he showed his Instagram. So when we were dancing, I was just like, like, why, did, why does, what is that? Like, why does it feel so firm? So I, I had no idea that he was a trainer or anything like that. And so while we were dancing, I was like, why is it like hard? And then when he finally showed me his Instagram, I was like, oh, oh, you one of those. Like, <laughs> you're a trainer. Oh, you got all these muscles and all this stuff, which that was also an exit for me. Like, I don't really try to talk to people like that. I'm just like, yeah, whatever. But at the same time, I was already with someone, so I wasn't looking for anything. And so um, that's how we met. That That's how... I saw it, and, th and then that's how we met. Was there anything you wanted to say about well, that? Well, one thing that that kind of like, <clears throat> well, not kind of, but what led me to her was really smart, really attractive, um, just beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, like you know, but like no, the beginning was like that was funny, you mm -hmm. know, but yeah, had had to read you know, on then it. this happened. Um, what else? It was it was more of like just the the sex news, you know and no ser no seriously <laughs> like because you know like we kissed like you know early 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 but did, did i tell you to say that no it's i fine, don't guys. care it's fine like, i don't it, care we, it, trust me now it, that it, that was one thing that's yeah. like an x x x x that, that's and, just something i do not do especially if i don't know you but that was the only thing that did happen and i was just like yeah, that was different. I guess I'm through with this other relationship, but it didn't go anywhere right away. <laughs> that didn't happen close, right though, away. But, but that didn't happen right away. No, it didn't. No, no. Um, no. and I will say, like after that, we did exchange phone numbers and stuff like that. And then, um, we at first we just time, became though. we just became really good friends. Like we both had significant others. One wasn't told to me, which I did not know. I actually found that out on my own. <laughs> Yeah, like I woke up and was like watching some stuff on um, YouTube. I don't know, if it, yeah, YouTube or something like that. And um, some girl was on there that just popped up. It just popped up on my thing. I wasn't looking for anything, and I was watching the video. And literally, you girls, you don't understand in your heart and in your intuition. Sometimes you just know things. And this, this is somebody I just met. I didn't even know him like that. But I'm somebody that is, you know, really God filled, and so I get these intuitions very quickly regardless and so i'm sitting there and i'm watching a video and i go while the girl is explaining i was like she better not say brian and this is somebody i just met and yeah. so as she's telling her story the picture pops up in the thing and i was like uh, um yeah that's brian the guy i just met uh he didn't say he was talking to anybody <laughs> Which was okay because I was dating someone. Yeah, you were He with was somebody. dating someone and we were just friends. So it was very innocent. It's just, I'm the type of person, like, even when you meet, if you're not even trying to talk at the first time, just, you know, just say it. Like, it, it does, you know, it's not a bad thing that, you know, you're not. But you have to understand how a man thinks. I get that. I get that. But at the same time, you know, I, you, to me, just be honest. Straight up, be honest. And he was dating someone that was, you know, very, like, prominent in YouTube. So, um, <laughs> no, you, you gotta finish. You, you, don't stop and laugh. Yeah, he you was dating finish. Maya. He was dating Maya. I had no idea. I really didn't even know who she was. And so um I was just like, oh, okay, great. Not Maya the artist, Maya the YouTuber. And so um I was just like, wow, okay. But we were just friends. So we just started hanging out as friends. There was no hanky panky. There was no none of that. None of that happened at first. <laughs> None of that happened at first. And so, um, yeah, we just, we started hanging out as just friends. Like he had his life with his whatever. And I had my life with my whatever, you know what I'm saying? And you know, whenever we would all hang out, like I would be with my girls, it would never just be me and him. Um, like he would have his friends. I would have my friends and we, we just all would just hang out as just cool friends, nothing big or anything like that. And then, you know, just as life happened, yeah. you know, you, um, I don't know, you start finding, you know, finding out that you like them more than you think 
I mean, you yeah, saying yeah, your yeah, head, yeah, you yeah, saying yeah. your head, like, oh no, it's not that, it's not that. And at the same time, I was, I'm a very understanding person. Um, and if I'm with someone, I'm not trying to pursue someone else. I don't know how people do like the triple and double and all these relationships and lying to people. It's a bit much. And in, especially as a Christian, it's really horrible to do because you're not supposed yeah, to be yeah, doing yeah, any yeah, of that, yeah, actually. Yeah. And so, um, yeah, we just was friends. And then eventually when I, uh, it was so funny, I had called him and I was like, yo, I'm single. And he was like, you liar, you liar. Yeah. I don't, it's, I don't it's, believe you did it. I don't believe you did it. And whatever. And I was like, uh, yes, I did. I done cut through. And so still, we just, even for years later, we still just were friends. Like, I, I wasn't trying to date anybody. I wasn't rushing to anything after a 14-year relationship. Yeah, yeah. So I most definitely wasn't trying to rush into anything. Um, So I was just still trying to find myself and trying to, you know, do me and enjoy myself, you know, by myself for the moment that I had. Um, until I decided, but he was like up on it, like, yo, you know, I'm trying to date and for like a year. And I was like, no, I'm not, I'm not trying to date anybody. I really need to get to know who I am first before I decide to, you know, try to talk to anybody else. Well, here, here's my take on it. Like I look at a woman in terms of how she is as a, as a mother and mm -hmm. as a caregiver mm -hmm. and you know what I mean? Like a caretaker. Yeah. That's where I'm at. And that's why we did that. <laughs> I would, you know I would, what I'm saying? <laughs> like that's why you got to do that. But and you know, you know, the, another thing that's really funny is, is a lot of times people will say to you that you'll end up with, like, I guess somebody that you you like or that you're attracted to. It's not that I wasn't attracted. It's just I feel like sometimes you end up with people that you don't expect that you think you're gonna be so much like into at the moment and that's kind of who you end up with because um it seems to take on like i guess the soulmate thing and, and working together as a team it works it actually really works when you um try to do it where you're not just like solely just so infatuated with someone but that you see them as someone you love but then at the same time as a really good friendship and partner hold up partner watch this Babe, wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up. You're gonna mess up the light. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? I hope they saw it. What? What were you trying to show? They both the same. Oh, I don't know if y'all saw that. All right. Um, yeah, we don't know how that's gonna work. Yeah. <laughs> so that's cool. No, we good. I don't even know if you guys saw that. You, you might have, but. Um, yes, that is how we met. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it, it was, it was, it was cool. Like, you know, like she's, you know, she was vibes and it, like, it wasn't like, like a rejects, you know, rejection situation. So, yeah. um, man, when you find that right one, stick with it. Cause the next one ain't going to be the best one. Oh, oh, he always tries to stick. If you ain't, if you're not I, I ready. Can't. Like, you know what I mean? Like, no, no. Say, all right, all right. No, all right, like, all right. Really? Let, let's leave it alone then. <laughs> oh, my God. He's always trying to spit some game. I can, the best one. I, that's, see, that's, that was no, one of the things at first I was like, oh, my gosh, really? Like, I was just like totally like, no, this, this is not for me. If you're not <laughs> ready, you better get ready. But Woo! Oh, hey. oh. I, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that's oh what it gosh. is. Yeah. I cannot. Yeah. But, yeah, so... Those are like some some juicy tales and things that we're going to talk about. But um, this is present day. This is us now. Um, but we have so many more sit downs and so many more things that we're going to talk about and to let you guys come on in because there's some important things coming up, um, especially once we got married. That's just a whole other thing. Marriage is a different situation. It is. It is a big job. Big job. Yeah, and it's Big no job. days off. At all. No at days all. off. And um, at all. And, that is true. Uh, <laughs> man, y'all better have a God in your life. You, you know better. What I mean? You better for it to last because yeah. it won't if you don't. Um, but, yeah, we have some things to talk about, more things to come. Um, I want to talk about a lot that's happening on being 40 and trying to conceive and have a baby. Um, but there is processes and things I also want to help 
with, um, I want to talk about it for African American women, us of color, on things and procedures and things that you're supposed to uh, check for before, you know, you try to do that. So those videos are to come. That is what's next and on the list to talk about. And um, yeah, we're just glad that you guys are here. Make sure you're subscribing, make sure you're liking and commenting. And if you guys have any questions, um, of course, we are not relationship experts, but um, we have been through some stuff now that I'm pretty sure we, A could, whole lot of stuff. we could answer some questions for you guys. Um, but yeah, we want to be able to uh, answer those for you. So what's the next video? Our next video, we are going to probably be talking about a procedure that I have to get um, yeah. when it comes to some things. I, I'm, I don't want to talk about it now because I kind of want to be in the other video, but you'll know once you see the title. But it's a, a procedure that I'm going to be getting so that we can get this baby on the road. And I would just say, <laughs> just learn to try to support your woman. Like, it's, 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 it's difficult, but... It's, for me, it's hard to support because you don't understand. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I don't understand what she's going through right now, but I will figure it out. <laughs> he has no choice. Yeah. We're together <laughs> forever. <laughs> it's like, no. Talk about it, babe. Talk about it. But yeah. I'm glad you guys are here. Yeah. I'm hoping you guys stay to the end of the video. Um, but make sure you're subscribing, okay? We need those subscribers. We need that watch time. Y'all watch it because we are now in it. Okay? No days off. All of your strength. Love you guys. And may be Clement. Yay!